and he is going to be calling out all of the main milestones in this uh, phase before the flight and during the flight. This is the voice you'll be hearing. So, uh, a word about the ignition sequence. Soyuz has a particular ignition sequence which allows us to check the engines. We ignite the engines 16 seconds before launch and then we throttle them up gently Attention pour moins une minute. to make sure that they're working correctly. Top. À zéro moins une minute. And we are one minute to launch. We are live at the Guyana Space Center and we're launching the first satellite for ESA's Copernicus program, Sentinel-1A, built by Talazelenia Space. And we're flying on board the seventh Soyuz to launch from the CSG. Our very best wishes to all the teams. Largage du Macazedem. À tous de DDO, attention pour la séquence d'allumage lanceur. Top. Largage du Mavkm. Allumage triétage à tous de DDO. Attention pour le décompte final. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Top. Et décollage. normal, les paramètres de commande sont normaux. Well, spectacular. We're off. We're hauling ourselves against the gravity of the earth. All 336 tons, the equivalent of 22 buses. He's telling us that everything is normal on board. We're heading north. We'll be heading out over the Atlantic, and we are burning five engines. Four on the boosters and one on the core stage. But it's the boosters that are doing all the work right now. They're providing 80% of our thrust. And their job is to get us away from the Earth because, of course, gravity makes us stick to our planet, stops us flying off into space. But it also makes it very hard for us to leave. These are spectacular pictures we're getting here, Philippe. How are you feeling? Yes, indeed, this is uh, very, very spectacular. Well, uh, of course, this is uh, a big relief because we're off the ground and it means that uh, all the preparation work is over. Uh, still the tension is not over huh? because now uh, I am and all my colleagues are uh, just uh, expecting and uh, waiting to see that everything will work uh, as uh, predicted. We should get lucky and see the separation of the boosters. There we go. We can see them falling away, those four dots. Isn't that beautiful? Sight. There they are, falling back down to earth. We don't need them anymore, and we are losing weight, Philippe. BVGD. Yes, indeed. Uh, uh, we're just following uh, one of law of uh, dynamics. I mean, uh, second law of dynamics from uh, Isaac Newton. And uh, for the layman, we could say, uh, if you want a fast acceleration, you better not carry any dead weight. Uh, 